your girl, Kimberly K. K with two Y's, Kimtastic Creations. I would like to say hello and welcome to all my returning fantastics. And if you are a new subscriber on my channel, thank you for becoming a fantastic. I greatly appreciate it. If you are not a fantastic of my channel, then please go ahead and hit subscribe. Also, hit the notification bell so you can be notified each and every time I do an upload. I would like to say Happy New Year's to everyone. It's 2020. This is my first video for 2020. If you have not checked out previous videos of mine, please make sure you do so. Um, you guys, I'm coming on here today to do a DIY on these tables that you see. Now, let me give you a little history of these tables. When I first bought these tables about 10 years ago, these tables were wood tables. The first time I painted these tables, I spray painted them and I spray painted them like a metallic silver. Then I came back and I spray painted them this gold. So what I'm going to do today, I'm going to DIY these tables again with some metallic paint. Um, it's not spray paint because it's too cold in Michigan to actually go out and spray paint. It's about 40 degrees. And I believe when you spray paint, the weather has to be like 60 degrees or above. So I'm going to go ahead and paint these tables exactly where they're sitting at. That's why I have that bag in the box and everything under the table. Um, I'm going to paint these tables a metallic silver. I'm going to add some gold sparkle to that metallic silver paint to try to give it like some gold sparkle pops, if you know what I mean. I think it's going to be very pretty. I have also bought these little lion knobs to add to the table just for de decor purposes only. And I think everything is going to turn out great. I'm going to start with first having my husband tighten up these tables. Then, of course, I already wiped them down, but I might go over them again just to make sure I got all the dust and dirt or anything that was on these tables. These tables have been through a lot. They were very, very loose and shaking. That's why I had my husband tighten them up. Now, let's get closer to the table. Now, you see this middle piece. I took it out because glass actually goes into those top pieces right there. The middle piece, top piece, whichever you prefer. But glass goes into those pieces. So, I removed the glass out. I'm going to paint this table. My paint is on the way. It's coming from Amazon. It's like five steps away. So, I'm very excited. But I already have like the gold glitter. And I have like the little lion hooks. And I think it's going to come out and be beautiful i'm hoping it comes out to be beautiful i don't know how the little gold sparkle gonna do i know you're supposed to sand that gold sparkle down once you're done painting i never used this this particular gold sparkle before so i don't know and i don't have a sander so i'm just gonna do my best and make the best of it now the reason why i'm painting these tables because these tables are going into my living room they've been in my living room they were moved out of my living room put back in it was back and forth with these tables but the coffee table itself is a brand new table and it's all mirror and it has sparkle and everything and that table was very very pricey so with these particular tables i'm like okay look i don't want to get any more end tables i don't want to put money into end tables so hey sometimes you got to use what you have and sometimes what we have is actually better than the new items that we might find because these are really some nice wood tables remind you these are wood tables and they are really nice. They just need a little love and tender care. That's all. So that is what I'm going to do, you guys. So stay tuned. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to sit. I'm going to wait for my paint. I'm going to show you guys the sparkle and the lion little gold hooks I have. And then guess what, y'all? We're going to get started. Well, I'm going to get started and you guys are going to watch some of it. I'm not going to do a whole video of me actually painting. I'll show you some of that. But you know how we do on YouTube. I'm going to try to make it a quicker video so you guys not sitting just watching a long, long video. But, um, yeah, stay tuned if you want to see me DIY these tables and you want to see the end result of the tables. So, you guys, I'm going to use these paint brushes. And this is the glitter I'm using. It's called My Glitter Wall. So I'm putting it on furniture. It don't say furniture. So I just hope it comes out well. I did see some reviews where people used it on furniture. So it should work well. And these are the little gold knobs. They're still in the pack. But I think they're really nice. I think they're really, really nice. There's one outside the pack. And as you can see, it's made like a lion. And I want to add that to the table. Those are the screws right there that you're going to use for these little lion knobs. And I think it's going to be good. So now I'm just waiting for my paint to arrive, you guys. So what I'm going to do is go grab me something to drink, some cold pop, have me a little snack, 
wait for my paint to come and i'm gonna get started you guys the paint has arrived so as you can see it's a metallic interior paint so it's basically a silver um paint i hope it comes out great um everyone that used it as far as i've seen in reviews i ordered this from amazon it had very good reviews so you guys i'm gonna go ahead and mix my um paint and my sparkles and all that good stuff and i'll be back So you guys, I have started to paint the um table and you can kind of see, but see what I'm not liking is these lines, but I'm going to go ahead and that was something I think I should have used a um, roller, but what I'm using is a brush, but you can still see the kind of sparkle of the gold. And I think once you do sand it down that you get a better um look. So like I said, I'm going to do my best with this. And make this work to my advantage. <laughs> um, sometimes you have to just work with what you got. And I want this done today. And sometimes it's also your stroke of the brush too. To like get those lines out. So I think if you go all one way. So like if you just go. You see down one way. You can kind of get those lines out. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. So I'm going to go ahead and paint this table. This is the first one. I haven't, I haven't even got to that, but you see the color different. So it's going from the gold down there to the metallic silver. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to um, get all down here painted. And then I still have this one over here to do, you guys. So that is my sparkle. I haven't put the whole bag in. I'm not going to do that. And then I did put a little sparkle inside there. So yeah. I'm going to get finished. Right, so I'm about to go ahead and add some more sparkle. And then I'm going to do a second um, coat on these um, tables. That's the second table I started. You see the line. So, of course, I'm about to do um, a second coat on both of these tables, maybe a third. And I decided to also use this for my dining room table. My top part of my dining room table is a marble, but the legs is wood. And I'm going to also paint those legs and around that dining room table with the same paint you guys okay you guys so the second is on there i'm going to do a third but you know it looks like i might need to go get a roller and i can't do that today but i might go over it one more time with a um with a um, roller but can you see all that sparkle in there And you can kind of see so it really is sparkling i say it that much that sparkle is really good so i'm going to let this dry and see how it looks and then i'm going to um probably run and go get a roller and just kind of do one wall coat of paint over both of them with um with a roller and go from there and then i also i don't know if i'm gonna do my wood the table today the wood legs of my dining room table i don't know because that's a large table but I'm going to go ahead and do these vases I have. I have these wood vases. And I'm going to show you guys the vases. And I'm going to um, paint those vases the same color as these tables. Okay, so that is the first one. And now I'm going to go ahead and do this second one. So it was like that. Like I said, that brown wood. And I'm not too fond of that brown would i mean like i said those um days like when i got these vases i was going with a different style in my home so the brown wood is just for us in my living room or wherever i plan on putting these because i really don't know i just still do not want that brown wood look going on okay you guys here's the second vase You can kind of see the um that gold sparkle real good on this face. 
Like it's really good. I really love this. Okay, you guys. I'm telling you guys, this sparkle is some good sparkle. I'll tell you that much. Like, it sparkles, but it's a way that you got to kind of do the, um, do the sparkle. But I do like how it sparkles. I, I really do. So, like I said, I'm getting a roller. And I'm going over it one more time. We have those vases down there and... Yeah, you guys, so I'll be back soon, you guys, to show you the after, how everything turned out. Once I go over it with a roller, and once I add the little gold lion um, knobs on here. But, I mean, it really does sparkle. You see that sparkle over there? Look, like, it's really pretty. So, you guys, I do love the um, sparkle that the gold gives. Like, if you can't see it on camera good, I don't know, but, like, it really does sparkle and I really like that like it's just really pretty finishing project